my journey started back in August 2021. It was the full moon night and my really good friend messaged me. He's like, do you want to travel the world? And I was like, yeah, but he's like, there's a catch. And I was like, what's that? He's like, you have to travel the world on Bitcoin. And I'm like, yeah, sure. Like, but what is Bitcoin? He's like, I'm giving you a book, read it. And he gave me the book called The Bitcoin Standard. As you start reading the book, the first 30 pages, they are enough for any person to just flip like, oh my God, like this is happening. Like this is literally happening around the world. And this is how it's all started. Also in the book, they told me about this wonderful lady British traveler. Her name is Nellie Ply and it was 1878. She circumnavigated the globe by using pounds, which was a new currency back then, and gold coins. And she did it. And I was like, this is 2021. I will travel the world by using Bitcoin. I am born in India, but raised up in Oman. I was managing the Royal Airport and I was getting a very handsome salary. Life was pretty good, right? But then just again, I was just a 24-year-old kid and I was like, there's so much more. And I started having travelers in my house. No money, just cultural exchange. I was like, wow, this is crazy. I was like, I want to try it for myself. And I went on to travel to Europe and I really loved it. I came back and I quit my job. I was supposed to take a one-year sabbatical, but it turned out to be four years. I hitchhiked all the way from United States to Chile. And I was doing various small jobs from being an English teacher, being a volunteer in hostels, a dishwasher, dumpster diving, selling peanuts in Peru, writing people's name in Hindi in Chile. And then I became a waiter for four months. My friend had just gifted me GoPro and COVID hit. And I just started vlogging. And he gave me this book, The Bitcoin Standard. And that's what I understood something important in life is proof of work. You work, you get rewarded. It's practically karma. What goes around, comes back around. My dad is literally 65. He doesn't believe in it. He's like, it's your life and you're going to live it. So go ahead, good luck. I have enough money to take care of me and your mother. You believe Bitcoin is a thing? Go for it. When my journey started, I had zero dollars. I sold my furniture got $200 of Bitcoin. And as soon as I started on day one, the first Bitcoin meetup we had in Bengaluru, one guy came and gave me $200 of Bitcoin. The day five, somebody gave me $300, then $10, then $50, and so on and so forth. It's going on. My plan is to do 40 countries in 400 days. But as soon as my journey started, in November, December, we had this new COVID that came in. And the plans got really slow. I have done so far eight countries. And the purpose of this journey right now in Africa is to get everybody connected. You know, I host Bitcoin meetups in every city that I go down to. I have found a restaurant here, a bar, a massage place. I feel Africa needs Bitcoin more than anyone else in the world. Like, you just know Sri Lanka just crashed down. Nigeria, you can just move almost $20 per month. All these countries are done. And what's going to save them is US dollar? Or is it going to be the CBDC? This world is being run by people. It's just like a puppet dance, you know? When you do a puppet dance with those two hands, you can do it for like half an hour, one hour, two hours. But after that, your hands start painting and the puppets start falling down. And this is what's happening around in the world. All the currencies are falling down. The countries are falling down. It's a big blow. It's happening. Fix the money, fix the world. It's just like a universe, you know? There's a sun and then there are nine planets. One will be the store of value and hyper-Bitcoinization is moving forward. All these cryptocurrencies that are in the system are utility and they are done to solve something, you know. They all will be backed by the Bitcoin. And yes, definitely, I will be living off Bitcoin for the rest of my life. Come on, guys, like, we're almost there. It's been, what, six months now, day 194. I will definitely do that. Yeah.